This call may be monitored or recorded for quality assurance purposes. Once we get you approved, we're going to schedule a drug test. Once you do the drug test and we get the results, then we're going to schedule the orientation. Welcome back, drivers, to the Recruiter Call Channel. And in this MTC, we're going to be looking at Zip to Zip Cargo out of Lamont, Illinois. This company reached out to the lockout men to give us information on what they have available for you. Again, this is an Illinois company, so you can take that how you will. They are a privately owned company based in Lamont, Illinois, where they are a relatively new player in the trucking business, but they are working with higher standards. Okay, so, okay, so yes. Tina, with mm -hmm. what trucking company? Zip to Zip Cargo. Zip to Zip. Z-I-P to right. Z-I-P. Yes, sir. Oh, okay, okay. Where you, where you guys, where are you guys located at or where you're based out of? We are in Lamont, Illinois, sir, and at the moment we have a lease purchase program going on. Uh, just wanted to give you a quick call regarding the details. Oh, okay. Go ahead. Yes. So, in our company, sir, what do you do normally? Drive and reefer or flatbed? Uh, reefer. All righty. So, you will be able to grow somewhere around seven up to $10,000 and get 88% of the growth. Okay, so wait, we eighty. Have, so wait, mm -hmm. eighty-eight percent of the gross, and I can I can get up to what now? Seven up to ten thousand dollar grossing, and you will be getting eighty-eight percent of the gross. Oh, okay, so eighty-eight percent of the gross, and up to ten. So is mm -hmm. that is that like ten thousand seven to ten thousand a week or a month? Yes, a week. A week. Okay, so this is a yeah. so this is a lease option or a lease purchase. Lease purchase. Okay, so I will be able to uh, lease with the option to purchase the truck after the lease. How long is the lease? Two years. Two years. Okay, so is that yes? Is that a walk away lease? Yes, it's a walk away lease. Okay, so after the two years, would the money truck is yours? Oh, okay, so all the money that I'm paying into the lease will go directly to the truck. That's right. Okay, okay. Uh, how much experience you guys is looking for for this? Two years. Uh, two years. How long have you guys been yes, in sir. existence? Six years. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Uh, do I gotta come in to do a to do a pre screening like a drug screening? And if so, what 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 is required of the you can drug? you can do so. First is doing an application. Mm -hmm. Once we get you approved, we're going to schedule a drug test. Once you do the drug test and we get the results, then we're going to schedule the orientation. Um, and the orientation is, it's in our office in Lamont, Illinois. Okay. So what's the, so for the drug test, is it urine or hair follicles? Urine. Okay. And to get me out to Illinois, how would you guys get me out there? Well, you will be able to come here with, uh, I mean, you can choose your own transportation, like flight, bus, or train. And once you get here, we're going to reimburse you the money for the, entire transportation okay okay all right mm -hmm. all right tell me a little bit about the trucks that you guys offering through this lease 2016 and 2017 cascadia freight liners we have one manual and the other ones are automatic the trucks have between 500 up to 700k miles on them and the payments are usually 500 per week for 120 weeks so it's not two years exactly, but a little bit over than two years. Two years and a couple of weeks more. Okay. So yeah. 2016 with about 500K miles on there, huh? A half a million. Yep. Um, 
So during the lease program, uh, like if the truck break down or anything like that, what what type of maintenance agreement did I have with you guys in order to keep the truck running? So we have we have a maintenance account which is ten cents per mile. Uh, those funds will be available on your disposal for any truck repairs, and the unused money will be refunded once the lease is over. Okay. Um, if by any chance uh, there is like a major breakdown on the truck and you don't have uh, the um, amount necessary on that account, the company can cover for it. And then we are going to uh, like to take it down little by little over a couple of weeks from your statement. Okay. Like from the, yeah. So quick question. So if I do have like, let's, mm -hmm. you know, just say hypothetically, you know, because you guys have given me a, a 2016, so I ain't no telling you know how you know how often the truck will break down, but let's say the truck broke down like majorly twice or something like that, and and okay. uh, and the maintenance or not the maintenance, but the repairs on it is you know astronomical. Of course, you guys would take care of it, but after the two year after the two year lease is up, and if I still owe you guys money on the repairs. The truck won't be mine until you guys get your money out of the repairs, right? So once you uh, once you're going to uh, like put in your last payment on the truck and you have everything cleared with the company, the truck is yours. Uh, you if you have like a breakdown, the, that breakdown uh, amount will be withdrawn in a couple of weeks. So I mean, we wouldn't be in a situation where you will have like many um, like. Uh, payments to cover at the end of your lease. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, uh, all right. Yeah. So being that this is a lease truck to me, uh, what is it governed at or is it ungoverned? 75 miles per hour. How many miles? 75. Oh, 75. Okay. Okay. Yes. Uh, any driver cameras in, in the truck? Uh, only an outward facing. I'm not sure about the, uh, even whether there is a camera, but if it, if there is, it's an outward facing, like through the highway. Okay. Okay. So let me go over this. Mm -hmm. So 88% on a, 88% on a low. Uh, so this is percentage pay. So would I be able to find, would I be able to look on a low board to uh, choose my own lows or? Or would you guys? No, sir. Or would uh, it you, be will have, you will have an assigned. You will have an assigned dispatcher who will be making sure you get the best loads out there on the market. But if you have an account of yours, like where you can go to the load board and see the loads, you can feel free to like see one and have your dispatcher call the brokers, negotiate the load, and then eventually book it. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. All right. So. What did what what kind of home time I'm looking at, or is it or being that I'm the least driver, I can choose my own home time? Our drivers usually go home every second weekend. We cannot afford less than that, but if you want, you can stay out longer and then collect more days for home time. Okay, okay. Um, mm -hmm. Is there a sign-on incentive with you guys? No, there is no sign-on bonus at the moment, sir. We do have clean inspection bonuses. Um, that uh, are go up to five hundred dollar per dollars per inspection, depending on the level. And we also have a longevity bonus that is uh, two five two fifty each quarter of the um, of the year. All right. Um, my last, yeah. I guess, my last couple of questions. Do you guys accept SAP drivers? I guess. Oh, okay. And my last question <laughs> is: being that you guys been only in in existence for like how many years? Six years. Who's yeah? What's your longest driver tenure there? For the you, you had a driver. Our for longest the, driver. Yeah, like you have a driver for. Did you have a driver for the whole from the, six years? From the very first. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah, so, we have a driver from the very first start. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, this yeah. is something. He's already leased leased his truck, and he is staying as a known operator, driving at the moment. At you. All right. Well, this is mm -hmm. something. Uh, this is something interesting to think about to keep in my back pocket. Um, eighty-eight percent for reefer for twenty sixteen is something that I really got to think about because, you know, mm -hmm. I I talk to other drivers in my network and, you know, they say they tend to say to stay away from older trucks because of you know because of breakdown mm -hmm. purposes, but. 
I mean, this is uh this is uh pretty good information. I I I think uh I think what I'll do is uh I'll I'll take this back with me and I'll 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 let some of my other driver friends know about you guys as well. So thank you for the sure, information. Not a problem. No worries, Mr. Lashon. I'll send you our full program so you can have it in your uh emails. Uh think about it, see if this is something that you would do and let's follow up with you in the next couple of days. All right. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you, Tim. Have a nice one. Mm -hmm. Who's next?